Republican vice presidential candidate Mike Pence just wrapping up a town hall meeting in Sarasota. KBC 7's Haley Wilkes joins us now live from the Hyatt Regency in Sarasota with more on what he had to say at that rally. Haley. Scott, quiet here at this hour, although the rally would have likely still been going on right now if it had not been rescheduled because of Tropical Storm Hermine. The campaign decided to move up the event to 2 p.m., although, incidentally, the weather still delayed Mike Pence by about an hour. When he finally arrived here at the Hyatt, he thanked the crowd profusely for braving the elements to be here for his event. And after addressing his support for Florida as we deal with this storm, Pence touched on the strengthening of the economy, the future of the Supreme Court, uh, the importance of national security and our what he calls integrity as a nation. He says we need to stop apologizing to our enemies and stand strong on the world stage. And of course, he addressed illegal immigration, pointing out the plan still stands to build a wall. Pence mentioning that Trump will share more specifics on those plans during his speech tonight in Arizona and fresh off his trip to Mexico. Mexico to meet with the country's president. They both got invited to go down to Mexico to meet with the president of Mexico, and Donald Trump is doing what leaders do. He seized the opportunity to sit down with our neighbor, and at this hour, a current leader of a nation and a future leader of a nation are meeting in Mexico City. I think immigration is huge. I think we need to do something about that. I think the ISIS problem is a terrible, terrible situation that nobody seems to really care about, or at least this administration isn't as much as I think they should be. As soon as Pence wrapped up his speech in Sarasota, he said he was headed straight to fly to Arizona. He will be introducing Trump before his immigration speech tonight. And now back to Tropical Storm Hermine. It is also affecting the Clinton campaign as well. Tim Kaine, the VP candidate, was expected to make stops in Pensacola, Panama City, and Jacksonville on Thursday and Friday. Those stops have been canceled because those areas are expected to get hit even harder than we are here. Here. Reporting live in Sarasota, I'm Haley Wilkes, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.